What's going on my fellow elegant savages and welcome to week three of my savage beer growth journey and let's go ahead and get straight into it. I know I'm looking a little crazy this morning, but let's be real. If you're still quarantining, who isn't looking crazy right about now? How are you all? So we're going to go ahead and get straight into my gains. And if you look at my mustache right here, I think next time I go ahead and line up my hair and I go ahead and fade the sides, I'm going to go ahead and cut down my mustache a little bit just because as you can see, it's getting pretty, pretty long. And sometimes during the day, like if it gets wet or anything like that, it actually starts to get in my mouth. So honestly, if the rest of my beard could grow like my mustache, we'd be good, right? But let's go ahead and get into what we're really here for. And that's to see where the beer gains at so this is week three like i said we're gonna zoom in let's actually not zoom all the way in let's see how it looks right now just kind of from a distance now again you can kind of see again like the sideburns coming in you can see this is my left side this is my strong side so we gotta start with this um and the interesting thing about this if i was to get on instagram and do a ig story right that's kind of like my test for this whole thing and i'm like recording and doing my thing i won't see this at all in the video right um and obviously this is a way better camera as great as the iphone 11 is oh my goodness as great as the iphone 11 is uh it's not gonna be uh this this camera that i have here but still that's kind of where i'm judging is my beard at a point where people can actually see the progress in person or be able to see it like across like a phone camera because when you can see the beard in that you know it's strong so let's go ahead and zoom in and see how we're really doing up close right like i said this is my left side this is my strong side right now um this is trying to come in a little bit and connect at the bottom up here we still have obvious patches that we can see that are already starting to form which is already annoying um but we don't have to get too too close to assess the progress there obviously I just told you about the mustache, how I'm gonna cut that down. And the goal is gonna be to try and cut these sides down without ruining my progress. So that's gonna be an interesting thing to go uh, underneath my neck. You see here, not too, too much going on. You know what I'm saying? Besides my, my chin here, not too much going on down there. And then, uh, unfortunately, you know we gotta get a little bit closer for the weak side and this is the right side so as you can see right here at the bottom it's trying to catch up to the left side but you can see the patch like coming all the way through here like all of this is bare uh, we got a patch here and the sideburns are trying to do their thing a little bit are you all so that is my week three progress and i'm not going to lie to you all every single time i get ready to line up my hair when i'm ready to fade the side of my hair i'm really fighting to not cut it off as you can see this is week three and there's like baby baby progress like we're really trying to crawl to the finish line here um i'm almost a month in and it's just like sheesh i feel like this minoxidil has not really did too much for me so but we'll see that's me being a little negative nancy uh, but we'll see where it goes. Honestly, committed to myself. I'm gonna at least try it for three months and see. That's typically where a lot of people have seen progress around that three month mark. So for me, that'll be about the end of July. Um, with everything that's going on right now, like I said, the mask that I have that I wear, it covers like my entire face, right? Except for when I wear my K95 sometimes, then you get to see the ugliness on the side. But for the most part, when I'm wearing my Elegant Savagery coaching mask, which I actually, oops, I actually got right here. You know what I'm saying? When I put this on, it covers like my whole mouth and my beard and everything. So I'm able to stick and move, you know what I'm saying, without people really seeing the struggle. So I owe it to myself and I owe it to you all to see this journey through. We're gonna go all the way to month three. And if it's still looking super, super crazy, then we'll reassess and see where we need to go at that time. But I hope you all are enjoying this so far. Again, if you're not on your journey, what are you waiting for? It's quarantine time, you have no excuses. Go ahead and hop on this Savage Beer Grow journey and let's get these beer games together. I'll catch y'all next time.